if I get in a body lock situation here, okay, and I want to step around him, all right, he's, I've slid my head to, my, my chest is covering his head. I know that my chances of walking around him are very slim unless I can put him back down to my hips, okay. All I'm going to do is lock on here, right, right at his chest, okay. Now, when I lock, I keep my elbows behind his triceps, meaning when I lock, I'm pulling those elbows up. And what I want to do is, once I lock here, I want to pull one elbow high and block right here. See, I collapse that. So I'm actually taking my right arm right here, and I'm taking it a little bit long right here, okay, in this position. And I'm locking right over the top of that tricep muscle right here. Post it out there, Pat. Okay, and now I break it down. And once I break it down, I high step, okay? And when I high step, I'm collecting his elbow up here. I'm burying that knee in there, coming back to my butt, coming back around, getting underneath his arms, okay? Make a half turn. So again, I'm here, this position, deep arm, okay? I'm blocking right over the top. I crowd, bust his arm down. When I step, I make a high step, okay? And now I want to plant that knee. I don't care if he reaches inside and hooks that, okay? The better, the more he does that, the the, uh, the actually the better this executes out. So from here I'm going to release, come right here, I'm going to extend that leg straight, come back underneath the arms. Okay, back up. So again, I'm here, he's posting up. He may be trying to get out of here. Okay, he might be trying to back out. Crowd, crowd, step, plant, reach. Okay, come back underneath the arms. Score points.